Hey folks, good morning. <clears throat> Happy New Year. Uh, today's Tuesday, January the 3rd. Good to see y'all. Hope you're off to a good start today. Hi Martha, yes. We are ready for a new year, a new adventure. So, we're not going to be on here long because a part of that is uh, I need to hear back from you. Um, I want, I'm going to do a redesign of this. Uh, this is a little morning devotional time. Um, uh, a couple of reasons. One, I want to make it just a hair shorter. I want to stick to maybe like six to eight minutes long total. So I'll redo my intro and some things like that. Um, but I want to hear from you. Uh, what are some things that you might find uh, helpful, uh, beneficial? Um, should it be uh, more just across the board for anybody? Should it be more localized to Kissimmee First Church? Um, I'm open to suggestions. I want to hear what you have to say. Now, just because you make a suggestion doesn't mean it's going to happen. <laughs> so I want to put that caveat out there. Okay. But uh, uh, I'm looking at doing a redesign. So uh, if if you are uh, uh, if you have some thoughts or ideas or you've been on here, you've been watching it for a while, it's kind of gotten old or stagnant or stale. Uh, we've been doing the same thing for like two years now. So uh, I want to I want to bump it up. Three years. Has it been three years? March will be three years. Wow. March will be three years. That's a lot of videos. Okay. <clears throat> anyway, that's the plan. All right. I'm going to start. Uh, I, I've got some ideas. I've been working on a little bit of things, uh, but I'm going to need your help. Okay. So if you can, let me know. Um, and we're going to keep this to kind of a six to eight minute thing on Tuesdays, Thursdays, we're gonna do Tuesdays, Thursdays. <laughs> Oh, there's one of them. Uh, we're still going to do it. Uh, there's number two. There it is. And uh, to keep it live, because I think live is important. Um, but, um, yeah, I want to do a redesign. And that way, you know, because sometimes we get as long as 12, 13, 14 minutes, and that can that can get a little bit long if you're just looking for a little short, quick uh, devotional, a pick me up, some things going on, some thoughts to think about. So that's where we're going to be. So I'm open to ideas and, and things like that. Um, I hope you all had a great, great uh, Christmas break, uh, 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 time with your friends, family, and then a happy new year. Um, we uh, we made it to Illinois. We drove straight through the day after Christmas, drove all the way to St. Louis, one shot, and uh, traffic was horrible. I thought we were never going to get out of Georgia. I think my average speed through Georgia might have, may, may have been 30, 35. It was just awful. Um, thank you. You're welcome. And then, um, <coughs> so once we get there, one by one, they start falling down like dominoes. Um, Aiden tested positive for flu A. The other kids, we didn't even take them in because we thought that's probably what it is. We had multiple with fevers, and as you can hear now, all the lingering coughing, runny nose, all of that stuff. So uh, the, the, the the circus is kind of laying low. Um, we came back a day early. We and decided. If anybody's wondering, there's a Motrin. Yes, if you're wondering, there is. For children. Uh, for children, there's there's Motrin, ibuprofen, and Tylenol. There's a shortage. So uh, the first day um, that I had to go find medicine, I had to go, I stopped at like four different places. So, and that's cross country. That's not just, and so we decided, uh, we ran out last night to get a couple quick things and batteries and some other things for the kids' toys. And uh, decided, let's buy some if they have it. And all they had were the chewables. So... If you're looking, if you have kids, you're looking for liquid stuff, or you know people, that's why there's a shortage. It's across country. If you find it, and you know people that have kids who could use it. It's so they have. Go ahead and buy it for them. <laughs> it's the infants. Yes. Is available. Infants the is available. It's the children's. It's that a, yes. You can't find. The children's mix. Now there are there are um, formulas you can you can use infants or you can even cut back adults and things like that. But um, there's ways around it. But if you, if you know people that have kids. Uh, it's a rough season for them. It's always, you know, sick, cold flu season. So uh, if you find it, you might go ahead and just buy it for them. Um, we're good. So we're, we're fine. Uh, so don't worry about yeah, us. Worry about yeah, don't worry about us. But uh, it's been a, it was a whirlwind trip. We left the day early, so we actually drove on New Year's Day, thinking the traffic would be lighter, and it was. Yeah. We it also we also chose a different route. Instead of going through Georgia and Atlanta on I-75, we took I-65 south through Birmingham, <laughs> and then kind of came in on 10 and went around the back way there. So, and that actually, it was shorter. Um, be, well, 
<laughs> due to traffic on the way there, it was shorter coming back. So, but <clears throat> we're back. Um, Got to get my coffee here. Angela brought me my coffee. Ah, it's hot. That's good. Oh, I can feel that's hot. It's warm. Feel like I did take a big sip. <clears throat> All right. So, that's what's going on. Looking at doing a redesign of this. Um, a, a, a repurposing. We want to make it shorter, more impactful. Um, that way, more people will, will take time to listen to all the way through. I was looking at some of the analytics, and there's only a handful of you that listen to this and follow it all the way through. Ooh, I got hiccups now from drinking that coffee too fast. Um, so, yeah, so there's that. Okay. Uh, and then uh, we're going to pick back up. Uh, everything starts back up again tomorrow. Uh, the church will be open. The office is open. Uh, Wednesday activities are happening. We are not going to start popcorn and snow cone this week. We're going to postpone it until next week. Um, so that way we can you know, get everything set where we need to be. Um, I'd like to see if anyone would be available during that popcorn and snow cone hour that we normally use. If you would be interested in coming to the church uh, around 1 o'clock and helping us take down some Christmas stuff. Um, that'd be really helpful. Um, I won't make you do stairs. I won't make you do any of that stuff. But we need to take Christmas down, repack it. We'll put it all into the tubs, and then I'll get some helpers to help me put all that stuff away. All right? If you're available tomorrow, Wednesday, uh, like like 1 o'clock in the afternoon, after lunch, all right? After lunch, 1 o'clock, give us a couple hours. Uh, we'll get it all take down, put away, cleaned up, and uh, ready for the next new season. All right, guys. Well, that's all I got for you today. Hope you're off to a good start. Uh, I want to just hop on, wish you all a happy new year, and uh, let you know that we're going to be doing some, making a few changes um, uh, because I think we need to. And uh, I'm just, I'm glad to be back. I'm glad to be with y'all. Uh, so we're looking forward to seeing you. Uh, I don't know if you'll see all of us Wednesday. Yeah, I don't think, I don't think you're going to see all of us Wednesday. We don't, we don't need to be sharing all this stuff with you. Um, and if anything changes between now and tomorrow, I'll be sure to let you know. So far, Gavin and I have been the only ones to avoid it. <clears throat> so, we have the super immune system. That's right. We're holding on. So, uh, the, the other six have all had it or are struggling with it and dealing with the effects of it. So, we're going to uh, do our best to see, uh, to stay healthy and uh, get stuff going. Um, so we'll let you know, but Wednesday, 1 o'clock, if you're able to, there's no popcorn or snow cone, but we could use your help taking down Christmas and putting some things away. Uh, and then finally, last but not least, we are right back at it. Uh, the homeless team will be serving uh, Saturday. And so if you, if you haven't and you want to participate, come on out, be at the church between 8.30 and 8.45 to get things rocking and rolling with that. Uh, if you notice some, some uh, activities up at the church, um, Cowboy football, eight versus eight, is back. The spring league is back, yeah. and so they're going to start practicing again. There's going to be a few more lights show up uh, out in the field, and uh, so it, we're getting busy again. It's just like that, right? We can take a short break, and we're right back at it. Uh, but God's got some great things in store. Um, we're going to ramp up our outreach like never before. Uh, 23 is going to be a great year. 23 is going to be an awesome year. But in order to make it, I need you. I need your help, I need your support, I need your prayers, uh, and I need uh, your presence. Your presence makes a huge difference. So there we go. We're ready, uh, we're ready to, to take off, and uh, God's doing some great, great things. All right, guys. Well, hope you're off to a good start today. Know that I love you, uh, that I appreciate you, uh, I'm thankful for you, uh, and I'm excited uh, to venture through this next year uh, with you and see what God does and what he has in store. All right, guys. Uh, love y'all. Appreciate you. He's having some fun in there playing games. So uh, we will talk to you all again really, really soon. Remember, if you have questions, comments, concerns, uh, send them my way. Um, if you have ideas, uh, what you'd like to see, what you wouldn't like to see, what you want to cut out, send that to me as well. And uh, we're going to look forward uh, to some exciting things happening. All right, guys. Love y'all. Appreciate you. Remember, as he's a blessing to you, make sure that you find an opportunity to be a blessing to someone else. We'll see you again. Bye-bye.